Okay, the rutabaga, not so widely used, is really pretty good. I'm gonna show you how to cut it up. It comes uh, just like this, with a, uh, a wax coating on the outside that's got to be removed. Let me show you how. All right, this is around. You need to take off the top and bottom to make sure it sits up nice. This thing is round, uh, so that's where we have to cut. We have to cut around the rutabaga. If I cut straight down, I'm losing quite a bit. So you can see it's, it's uh, pretty firm. Try to take just a little bit off. Keep that motion of going around the rutabaga. So the rutabaga, it's a, a cross between a cabbage and a turnip. If you want to substitute potatoes in a dish, this is a fine choice. All right, now I've got the rutabaga all peeled. I simply cut into large planks. You can see the size of those. Uh, I, I do want it a little bit larger. So we have those cut. Kind of get things straightened up here. And then each one of the planks can be cut down into maybe slightly larger than bite size. And there you go. Rutabaga all cut up. All right, so the rutabaga really is dynamite. You can eat it raw, but usually it's cooked, either uh, kind of stewed, simmered. Um, you can do a blanching and a roasting of it. Uh, whatever, have fun, enjoy. Bon appetit.